I'm Allison from HealthNutNation.com, your certified nutritional consultant. Today I'm going to show you how to pick a perfect pineapple and how to know when it's ripe and ready to cut. The first thing I do at this store to determine if this pineapple is a good one is I give it the sniff test. If it smells sweet and pineapple-y, then I know I've got a good start. Then I push around the base of it with my thumb, and if it's mushy, I put it back. That means it's overripe. But if it has a little bit of a give to it, then I go on to the next test, which is to see if there is a golden color around the bottom. That means that it's starting to ripen, and it has a pretty good chance of continuing to ripen once I get it home. So once you've got your pineapple home, you want to be able to determine when it's ripe and ready to cut. One of the ways to do that is to see this nice golden color come all the way up the pineapple. Now, not all of them will do that, but um, this one, as you can tell, has got that nice golden color all the way up. So now I'm going to take from the crown of the pineapple and I'm going to pull on one of these leaves. And if it comes out nicely, then I know it's ripe. When you decide that it is ripe and ready to eat, make sure that you wash it first and then give it a nice pat dry. And then you're gonna just twist this crown off. Hold it firmly and just twist it like that. Now, because this pineapple has likely been sitting on its seat like this, that means all the sugars have basically collected in the bottom. And in order to distribute those sugars evenly throughout the pineapple, you just take that crown off and then place it for at least 30 minutes, uh, maybe on a jar or a glass of some type, on your countertop or in your fridge. There are a lot of different ways to cut pineapples, but this is my favorite. First, you cut off the rump end of it, and then the crown end of it. And then you just cut it in half. Cut it in quarters. So next I'm gonna take out that woody core. Just cut across the apex of your triangle there. And then I'm gonna cut that quarter into an eighth. Since I'm chunking this pineapple, this is such a quick and easy way to do it. Actually, this is a lot like cutting up a cantaloupe. Just cut right down the rind. And there you have beautiful chunks of pineapple and all those little eyes are already removed. So there you have it, the easiest way to pick and cut a pineapple. To your health.